This user has earned more than $41,000 using this trading bot. This user has earned more than $51,000 using this trading bot. And this trading bot has made more than $68,000 on Binance. Is Binance bot trading really so profitable? Yes and no. With the futures trading bot you can make a lot of money fast but you can also lose a lot of money fast if you don't know what you are doing and that's why you must watch this video until the very end so you don't miss out on any word I say. In this video I will show you 4 tools to trade crypto like a pro on Binance Futures. I will show you where to find and use Binance trading bots. I will show you multi simple trading baits that many professional traders are using. We will also go through smart trading such as trap algorithmic trading. But the first thing you need to have when you want to do anything with Binance is a Binance account that you can create 100% free. I will leave your link in the description below my video. You click here more and you can get up to $600 worth of bonuses using my link or my referral ID that you can see below my video. And this is perfect for you if you are planning to do futures trading because you can get up to $500 worth of bonuses for futures trading. You can see all the details here or on this video on my playlist earn money on Binance. So you click right here, you will land on Binance registration page where you can create a free account using your phone number, email address, Google account or Apple ID. For example, if you want to use your email address, you click right here. Then you fill out your personal email address here. You create a password. My referral ID with the best bonuses automatically being added. You tap the box here. You click the yellow button here, create personal account and you will be inside Binance for free. When you want to start using futures trading on Binance, you can do it here on derivative section or here on trade and strategy trading. It says trading made easy, trade like a pro. And today we are going to focus on these four tools to trade the crypto like a pro on Binance. And when you start futures trading for the first time on Binance, it asks you for a referral code. If you don't want to pay so much trading fees, you can use my referral code Unest10. You can see it right here and you can see that it asks in a box like this. You put Unest10 there. Let me show you right here. And then it gives you a 10% discount. So if other people would pay, for example, $100 in fees, you pay only $90. If others would pay $10 in fees, you pay $9. So you you pay less fees than other people. And we start first by going through these four tools to trade crypto like a pro on Binance futures. They are grid trading, trap algorithmic trading, advanced stop and loss. I will show you how to set it up and multi simple trading page. Let's start from this page of strategy trading where are four different trading strategies. Spot grid, futures grid, trap and VP. I explained all of these in great detail in our previous video. If you haven't watched that, I'm sure you will find it really helpful. But in case you haven't seen that, I will explain this in a nutshell in this video and I will give you some tips for using this. Let's start with this trap algorithmic trading and it means time weighted average price. And let me show you here on Binance blog post. I will leave you some of these resources in the description so when you click more, you will be able to find some of their blog posts so you can even read more from their own website. But this is for people who are using really high order sizes. So you are trading with a lot of money, but also if you anticipate, if you expect a lot of price volatility with no clear up or downward trend. Let me show you here this example. So here they show that, for example, if a contract price drops from 20 to 10, but then it starts going up, you can see if you are using TWAP, you will be able to get more or less this average price, time weighted average price. So your risks of getting liquidated are much, much smaller. However, you don't always benefit from that because uh, if the volatility is not high or if your liquidation price is so far away, then it doesn't really matter. For example, I have one trade open here with around $1,000 worth of Bitcoin. It has earned some profit and you can see the liquidation price is around $15,600 for Bitcoin. So I'm not anticipating that Bitcoin would drop immediately right there. So in that case, I don't really need this TWAP. But if you are expecting that the market would move like this in a moment, then TWAP algorithmic trading may be useful for you. Or if you are trading with the high volume because high volume trading may move the markets. But if you are using TWAP algorithmic trading, then it doesn't move the market so much, right? And when you want to use free trading bots on Binance, they are by the way 100% free. You don't need to pay extra fees only the normal trading fee here on Binance. So that's awesome. Some other platforms, they charge you monthly fees, $25, $37, 
49 dollars a month here you don't need to pay such monthly fees and you can see the total value in these bots at the moment is almost 100 million dollars when you're watching it it's probably much much higher and spot grid is obviously the most common one but futures grid is quite common as well here on strategy pool you can copy other people's strategies you have learned in my previous videos why i don't personally recommend copying other people's strategies but everybody is free to choose so if you copy other people's strategies you can for example click here use parameter and it fills out these parameters immediately for here based on what other people have been using with futures grid compared to spot grid is that with futures you are using leverage so your profits and losses will be amplified you can earn money faster but you can also lose money faster and here on create strategy you can create your own trading bot or you can actually set up the trading bots that they have you click here create then it gives you always this quick walkthrough right here that you can read yourself or you can simply skip it if you have seen it already and here you can always find some helpful information and there are two options how you can use this bot first you can use this auto function so the ai parameter so their bot fills out all the numbers automatically some of you asked me in the previous videos in the comment section that what does this time period means that if you choose seven days or 30 days or 180 days does it lock that bot for a certain period of time and the answer is no and it shows here the explanation you will be advised on different recommended parameters based on the duration of the strategy your recommended parameters will vary depending on what time period you select so this is basically if you are planning to hold the bot open for 100 80 days you can see the lower price and upper price it will be wider range compared to 7 days it will not be so wide range so this is just for the parameters you can open and you can close this anytime so it's 100 percent flexible you can see the difference is only in the grid number and all of these parameters so the recommendations are a little bit different depending on how long you are planning to keep that bot open but it doesn't lock you for anything you can close it anytime you want sometimes people also ask what do these neutral long and short mean and the explanations are also here on the bottom neutral is ideal for range spout markets create sell and buy orders with greed you can see right here it's good in a sideways market when the price of an asset goes down up down up buy sell buy sell and so on and so forth and long is ideal for trading and volatile bull market because with this one you will be opening long positions with the grid and as you learned in previous videos long basically means that you expect the price of an asset to go higher and short is ideal for trending and volatile bear markets and it will be opening short positions with grid in the other words you expect the price of an asset to go lower so this is basically based on your own prediction do you expect that the market goes sideways then choose neutral do you expect the price of an asset to go higher then choose long if you expect the price of an asset to go lower then you choose short so you can make money in all kinds of markets then you choose the leverage right here and as i always say i recommend maximum five preferably even smaller leverage then you decide how much money you put there it shows here the initial minimum margin and of course by changing these parameters the number of grids lower price and upper price the minimum will be changing once you are ready you click here create and you will be able to see all the running orders here on the bottom of the page with this manual setting you will be able to set up everything manually so let's say that you see the auto function and you don't have for example enough money for this then you can set up this manually and then the minimum price will be based on what you set up right here and one of the functions that you probably want to use if you want to do professional trading is here advanced and it's take profit and stop loss binance also calls it the trigger price you can set up here a specific trigger price for example when bitcoin goes to 30 thousand and then you can for example close all your positions so cancel all orders so basically it will stop your bot when it reaches a specific price and you can also set up the specific bottom price and top price for triggering this so instead of sitting on in front of your computer 
or in front of your phone like this you can basically set this one so it closes your bot automatically and you don't need to be monitoring the price all the time so it makes the process easier for you for example when you are sleeping and then bitcoin reaches a specific price then the bot can close everything automatically for you when you have set these prices right here one feature on binance futures that many people are not aware of is this multi symbols mode let me show you how you can set it up so when you come to binance futures for the first time right here on this overview and of course here on derivatives and right here when you come here you decide whether you want to trade usd and futures or coin and futures personally i most of the time trade coin and futures and you can see one trade open right here with some profits but when you come here to settings you will be able to choose now i'm using the advanced mode you can also use the full screen mode so it will look like this but then there is also multi symbols mode and this is great for professionals who want to be trading several positions at the same time because now you can see many different charts here on the screen and you can change this for example here you would see btc usdt the one that i'm trading is coin and futures btc and usd perpetuals and then here we can choose a third one right here for example ethereum and usdt perpetual right there so now you can analyze three different charts at the same time and when you see the right price you can hit buy long sell short whatever you want to do but of course i recommend before you start using this just focus on one and learn the basics then once you become more advanced you can start using multi symbols mode to trade many different pairs at the same time. One of the helpful features on Binance is also multi assets mode. That works in the USDT and BUSD perpetuals. Let's change here for the advanced view and I will show you right here. When you click this button right here and you choose here preferences, you go down, you can see here multi assets mode. It means that you can use both stable coins, BUSD and USDT together instead of using just one right and it can lower your risk because let's say you have for example 100 usdt and 100 busd it's not so much collateral but when you use multi-assets mode you can use both of them at the same time 100 plus 100 that's 200 dollars right you can use both stable coins to diversify and lower the risk and that can also save your time because you don't need to convert your usdt into busd if you want to trade that one or vice versa you can just hold both stable coins BUSD and USDT and you don't need to do this back and forth transferring and if you're a beginner with futures trading I really recommend that you check out Binance's articles for example about risk management there are a lot of good tips for example here first of all have a trading plan that you follow so you are not just randomly clicking buy and sell based on your emotions because that's not going to lead into good outcomes and also this fifth advice only invest what you can afford to lose so I use the same principle for futures trading that I would use for government currencies so US dollar and euro only holding government currencies such as euro dollar Indian rupee British pound only hold that money that you are willing to lose because as you know in the long term government currencies have lost almost all of their value so almost everything that you hold there it will go towards zero for example US dollar has lost more than 80% of its value in the last five years and the same with euro 84% lost in the last five years if we take around seven years it has lost around 99% of its value and the other government currencies have lost even more so the same principle applies to futures trading don't invest too much on them because the risks are higher in the same way like with government currencies however with futures trading is the benefit that you can also make money because with government currencies you are almost guaranteed to lose money if you hold euros or dollars or british pound you are almost guaranteed to lose money in the long term with futures trading you can of course make money as well but of course the safest place to hold your money is my personal opinion in bitcoin because it's the strongest form of money ever seen on planet earth that is not an investment advice not a finance advice simply an observation of the facts and the numbers if you have any questions about futures trading on binance 
setting up the trading bots or anything else check out my previous tutorials as well and ask me in the comments below i will be more than happy to help you out and then click the link in the description to sign up to binance if you haven't already and see my playlist earn money on binance for many other ways to earn money on this platform you and me my friend we are going to see you in the next video immediately